graded coin box break. Seven times through for the owner name, seven times through for the years. And we'll be stacking the list up side by side after they run through here. You'll get your year. Lucky number seven. If the coin doesn't fall within your year type dates that are owned, it will go to random between everybody. Most of the time they do fall in the, this type of for this within this year, within these years, they do, they do often fall. Hey, Jason, how are you tonight? Happy Saturday night, man. So I can't wait for Sunday and football. Here we go. Seven times. Football Sunday, and, and then there's all the postseason action going on and MLB, so it's just a great time for us for enjoying sports, isn't it? Here we go. Lucky number seven. I think 14 to present ought to be a pretty good spot. 14 to present. Oh, it did? Okay, I, I, I heard it might, but I didn't get the confirmation. Oh, my gosh. Okay, it did get postponed. Just like the Titans game. Jeez. Wishing you the best, Mike and Frank and everybody in this thing, man. Carlos, can't wait to see what it is that comes out of here. What kind of coin is it going to be? Is it going to be an oldie? Is it going to be a new one? It's a graded coin. Good luck, everyone, in the rip. What is this? What in the world do we have here? It's a 1902 Indian head coin. It's an Indian one cent. 1902 graded. coin so isn't that interesting and I've never seen a grade where it says cleaned so at some point what I'm what it, it appears that this coin at some point someone had decided to clean it and I never never seen a grade and it says cleaned <laughs> <laughs> well, it's a very cool hit. <laughs> no one owns 1902. <laughs> it says cleaned on it. Somebody was scrubbing it. It's hard to get the camera to really focus in on it. Usually we have better lighting. Somebody cleaned this thing, man. Not supposed to do that, but it's still very collectible and rare. Not supposed to clean them. All right, so uh, let's do the random. 
You know, I think it's uh, 1902. SVBD or something. Yeah, it's 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 not O three. It might be O one or O two. I can't remember which. But I know which one you're talking about. It's like worth millions. There's one. Of, there's one of these. And I think it's a wheat penny. I thought it was a wheat penny. But anyway, I think it's 1922, Sam. There's one of these things worth millions, multi-million dollar penny. And now you've got me really curious. I don't know the answer to that. All right, so here we go. Winners at the top of the list, average seven. Is it 1909? Thanks, John. Do we got any true coin collectors in the house? <laughs> I know we got a couple true coin collectors around here. Here we go. Seven times. Seven times. Winners on the top list. Average seven. No one owned 1902. Uh, so we got to put it to random. No one had the year. Winners at the top. After seven. Lucky number seven, Carlos V. Congratulations. This one is for you, my man. Seven times through, and you have pulled down the Indian head penny. It is a one cent. I think pennies and property say in the coin world, they don't say pennies. They say cents. It's a one cent piece. And uh, so anyway, 1902 on this bad boy. Congratulations. A real piece of history right here. Very neat, neat hit. It's hard to even see the back of it. Pretty cool stuff, man.